Alright, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy TikiToby420X here, and today, as you can tell, I'm playing on my phone once again. Um, today, I'm going to be playing a little bit of Avable. i got a few friends that are going to be joining me here in a few minutes. Um, i got to jump in real quick, check out what's going on, doing all of that, uh, and why is it stuck at 1%. There we go. All right, let's do this, guys. <clears throat> and it froze. That means there must be a lot of people on Channel 6 right now. Or I just was going too fast. All right, gotta click this stuff. Let's see what I get out of this today. Ooh, another SP orb. All right, back out. Guild mail. Let's see. Let's go like this, go to guild. Alright, let's see who's all online right now. Oh, what? How come it's not showing my guild? And there's a the homie, James. And why is it linking? Damn, how come it's so freaking laggy right now? Damn, I got, I got, oh shit, I'm only at half Wi-Fi. Um, let me go, I'm actually gonna move into my kitchen. So hold on real quick, guys. Alright, sorry about that. <clears throat> And I meant my living room, not my kitchen. And yet it is still frozen. Go like this. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, and if you guys don't know already, Baby Metal is a shit. Go check them out. I'll leave a link of, to one of their videos in my description below. So, yeah. You, you guys should just go check them out. They're amazing. I, they're a, a metal Japanese band, and they're actually they're actually um, a metal pop band. Like some of their music is metal. Is well, their music is more metal and J-pop rather than anything. Um, but like I said, I'll leave a link in the description below. Another good band is Band Made. And, uh, Aki, Akiri, Akiri, Mon, Omuru, or Omu, that's another really good band, I don't know how to pronounce it, I'm not Japanese, I am learning Japanese, by the way, <laughs> so I can't pronounce their names, please leave a call, please leave, I'll leave a link in the description below, for that to them too, and I will continue on, continue on. I actually had to restart my game right now. Um, I'm sorry about that, guys. I'm sorry about the the whole thing. Right now, I'm just trying to play to play. Um, so let's hopefully let's hope that I could actually get some good stuff in right now. And hopefully it don't freeze on me again. Let's log in. Let's do this. Alright. 
alrighty then. Go into guild, go like this, shout, whisper, system, and actually I'll put say, uh, sorry, DC'd, disconnected, by the way. Let's come here. I gotta go check the stall. I gotta go check if some of my stuff actually sold. And if it didn't, then I'm just gonna get it back and I'm gonna save it and do some stuff with it. Um, Avable is actually an MMORPG. I absolutely love it. The people in here are friendly. I have met nothing but good people. So, yeah. Let's see, exhibit, uh, the SP fragments have been returned, item has been returned since 48 hours has passed. Uh, all my stuff got returned, damn, nobody bought it, that's kind of fucked. Uh, ch -ch 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 let's see. I gotta come here, come here, come here. Uh, character, let's see, go into my bag, I actually wanted to, uh, use some of these boxes, or, yeah, these boxes that I had, like, the platinum box three, and I got a few HP recoveries, I'm actually gonna use those, so that way I can go merc on a floor or two, so I can see what's going on in that, ooh, HP recovery, Oh, wait. I don't have no more platinum boxes? Uh -huh. Extracting box one. Energy drink. Let's see. Shining crystal. Um, I don't think I need those, but okay. They will go toward my guild. HP. Right now, I'm just stocking up on large uh, health potions because um, I'm actually going to be going to floor 9, and I'm going to be trying to take out the floor boss there, so I'm going to be trying to do that. Uh, so yeah, let's get down to it. Um, put my shining stone in here. Put my intense orb in there. Uh... Fairy glass S, put it in there. YouTube, no. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'll keep the support book. I'll keep the first aid kit. Um, summon stones. I will put those in the stall. Lucky candy, I'll keep. Iron ore, I'll keep. Ch -ch -ch actually consumable uh, let's see medium put it in there red red pill put it in there inner put those in there uh, whirlwind pill what the hell does that do there's this 10% of move speed and for a period of time when used made from an essence of whirlwind leaf. Bitter taste lasts a while, only effective in the map in the map used. Oh, so basically what it is is it, it'll only be effective in that certain spot. I'll keep all of that. Uh ch -ch -ch -ch. let's see, come back here. Let's put you away. Weapons, I'll keep that. Uh, let's see, I... Oh wait, I could get rid of all of those. I don't need those. Put my SP or back. Those are stuff that I don't need. That's actually stuff that I just recently got. Um... Oh, what? How come none of my attacks and shit stayed? Character skills. Alright. I said it did. 
Oh, okay. No wonder why. I had that the uh thing. All right, come here. Let's go to sell. Item bag, storage, let's go here, go to armor, whoops, I accidentally clicked weapon, go to armor, go ahead and do that, weapons, but what, I don't have no weapons, it's storage, collectibles, um, I'll just do this. Oh, I want to give a shout out to the homie James. I want to give a shout out to the homie James and Emily. I think that's how you pronounce her name. I wanted to give you guys a shout out. Um... I don't know what to say, <laughs> but you guys are awesome. I love this guild, and you guys are, I love everybody in Free Nights. Y'all are just really good people. You've all, you guys have all showed me really much, you guys showed me a lot of, uh, how can I put it? Everybody in Free Nights, you are very friendly. You guys are very friendly. You guys show nothing but friendliness. You guys are very good people, and I would not, I would very much rather not be in a, a different guild than your guys's. You guys are epic. You guys, like I said, all you guys do is show care and respect about your teammates and your guild mates. I mean, look at this. Let's see. Ch -ch 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 chat log. All right, uh, Emily and James, they actually, James was helping Emily to uh, give her, to, so that way she could get a 10-star weapon, and honestly, that's what a clan, or a guild should do, sorry, I'm talking Black Ops 3 terms right now, clan, <laughs> but uh, that's what a guild should do they should help each other out you guys are awesome you guys have always even even when i didn't play for a while you all had my back and you all let, still sat there and considered me family and you all considered me good people and you guys are freaking awesome i just want to say thank you guys you guys are epic all right i'm actually gonna be going to floor nine so i gotta uh i'm going to Floor nine to kill floor boss. All right, there we go. Let's do this. Let's get going. We got this shit. I mean, I, I used to play this game a lot, if, as you guys couldn't tell. I am already level 68. I'm actually about ready to level up again, which is good. Oh, shit. Gotta run. Gotta run. Gotta run. And in all honesty, I really like the fact that these guys only do, like, 70 damage to me because... And I do, like, 600 to them. I mean, it just, it, it's kind of funny that I do that much damage. I honestly did not think I did that much damage before. Go into the light. And see, they do such low damage, but the boss, though, that's the one thing that always gets me is the boss, like, 
I mean, the boss is fucking strong. Like, don't get me wrong, he is strong. I'll use that. Might as well you. Uh, no. Recovery. Shortcut. I want to put that on a shortcut. Let's put it. And see, I'm just letting here, letting this fucking wolf kick my ass. And yeah, I'm still, I still lost barely any health. And I'm sitting here doing all kinds of different shit. EXP, uh, cancel shop. Green foreign paper drops for 5% five, 5 more chance of drop. And a lucky candy for 35% more drop. All right, let's get down to it. But um, I do got some good news, and I got some really good news. I'm going to be starting to get everybody in my clan on PlayStation 3 from BO3 to start doing videos, so that way we all could... We all could actually go out and make some videos of our own, talk about some stuff that's going to be happening with the clan, and talking about other stuff, and just sitting there bullshitting. Grims. Strong bone and memory in the snow. Nice. Ah. Uh, let's go like this. Put you there. Start attacking the boss. Get this bitch down. <coughs> Take out his little youngerlings right here. Oh shit. I'm almost dead. No. I need my health. Damn, what the hell just did 900 damage? Holy shit. All right then, that was a fail. Now, time for round two. Aw, or maybe not. Um, I'll go and do a sh easier boss because obviously floor nine ain't helping me all that much. Let's go do floor seven. No, floor seven don't have a boss. Let's go with floor... Actually, you know what? Fuck it. We'll go to floor ten. And just kill some stuff up there. Right now, I'm just trying to gain a little bit of EXP. And I'm trying to do a little hunting while at it. So that way I could get some guild points for the guild room. Um, right now, I hope... I'm hoping that a lot of you guys like this i hope you all like subscribe and support my channel and you you guys you guys are amazing all my followers all my subscribers i want to say you guys are all epic you guys have been you guys have shown a lot of respect toward me and that's and that's kind of what i like i mean you guys you guys don't put me down if i do bad in a video or Oh, you need to change this, or you need to change that. I mean, yeah, I know I know that I need to change some stuff. Ah, oh, shit, I'm just getting attacked left and right. Shit, that actually hurt. I wanted to go the other way. Ooh, what the hell is that? Look, it, it kind of looks like a Pokemon, to be honest. But I'm going to kill it. <laughs> Ooh. Claws lost property. What the hell is that for?
Anyway, I have no idea what the hell is going on with the clause lost property thing. Um, if anybody could tell me what the hell is going on with that, please let me know. Because, like, I have no idea. It's been so long since I since I've played a game, played this game, that I have no idea really what's going on anymore with it. I mean, a lot of new stuff has been added, and a lot of new stuff, and a lot of new characters, a lot of new people, and I mean, it, it's just crazy how much get, how much popularity this game has had since I've been off it. I mean, Everybody in this game is really friendly. I highly suggest it to a lot of people who love playing MMORPGs or playing MMO games, period. I mean, it, it's just an amazing game. Like I said, there's a lot of friendly people. But then again, you got those... Then again, you eventually got those ones that aren't so friendly and do nothing but talk crap. But, I mean, you can't let that stuff stifle you. I mean, you got to do you, and they'll do them, you know? I mean, you just can't... You just got to... You got to be on your be on you. Don't worry about what other people are saying about you. I mean, because in all honesty, a lot of people, yeah, they will talk crap, and they will try to hurt you and try to make fun of you. I mean, I've had a hell of people try to make fun of me before because on this game because I was such a weak level or whatever I mean and honestly I don't even let that bother me because I mean what's the point if it just if I let it bother me then I would let them win I, they would have the benefit of the doubt and I mean you just gotta be you I mean you can't let other people judge you I mean in the end the only person that could judge you is your peers and by your peers, I'm meaning, like, I know I probably don't say it a lot, but I do. But the only people that could really judge you is God and your mom and dad. I mean, other than that, I mean, don't let other people do it. Because, I mean, once you show that weakness and allow other people to judge you for who you are or what you do then they're just going to take advantage of that. And honestly, a lot of people actually do that nowadays. And it's I, I honestly hate it, seeing people judge other people. Hell, I've seen videos up on YouTube where people are just sitting there talking shit to this one kid or making things worse for one kid because he's different. I mean... Hell, I'm the type of person where I, I could get along with anybody and everybody. And if you can't do that, then I mean, what, I mean, what's the point in judging someone when you don't even know them? I mean, a lot of people, they're, when I was younger, a lot of people used to judge me for who I was. Because I didn't wear this clothes, or I didn't like this fucking name brand of shoes, or... I didn't wear Jordans, or I didn't do this, I didn't do that. Not everybody could afford fucking Jordans. Those are like two, three hundred dollar pairs of shoes at fucking high end shit. And I mean, I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna go to Walmart and buy some fucking weak ass Jordans because of stupid shit. Because I want somebody to like me. Nah. In all honesty, if you're gonna, if you, if you do that, then don't, don't let them. Because once you let them, then they know that they got control. And if they got control, <clears throat> then, then, then they'll just do anything and everything to hurt you. And I mean, I'm the, I, I, I'm the type of person where I should listen to my own advice. Give or take, I should. But, you know, I don't. I mean, I give the best advice, or I could help you out with a lot of shit that you're going through in your life, or, you know, just help you out plain, plain and simple, but, like, a lot of people, they don't understand what bullying does nowadays. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of movies, there's a lot of this, there's a lot of that, I and shit like that about bullying and stuff, but... They don't really know what happens unless you really actually get bullied. I mean, 
I was bullied when I was younger. I used to get picked on. I used to get fucked with. I used to get hated by people. I used to not be able to speak to girls. I used to be able... I was not able to fucking get a girlfriend because of that said factor. And a lot of people would make fun of me for it. But once I got up the courage to do it, I mean, wow, that was actually a lot of stuff that I just got. (laughs) But, I mean, as I was saying, just because somebody tells you oh you you're stupid for this or you're stupid for that i mean you you can't let people stifle you like that people will be people and you know it's like i always say haters gonna hate and a player's gonna play you just gotta know the game and you just gotta be that player and not give in to the fucking bullshit that other people are dragging you down about i mean i got a lot of people I got a lot of people on my back with the whole guild on this, and I got a lot of people on my back in my game COD, in, in my clan on COD, but, I mean, it's not just about that. I mean, I I got friends, I got family that actually got my back in real life, too, but, I mean... There's just some stuff that a lot of people don't understand about me is I'm not the type of person to open up quickly. I'm the type of person where I keep my shit shut out because I don't trust you. And I mean, there's a lot of people that I do trust. And then again, there's a lot of people I don't. It just depends on who you are, what you do. You know what I mean? You just got to like, I mean, I see a lot of rappers out there nowadays. They're always sitting there saying, oh, do you? Oh, do you? But in all reality, fucking all the little kids want to be like them. And I mean, like, for real. Okay, for real. You want to sit there and be like a rapper and talk about bitches, talk about money. Yeah, talking about money and talking about bitches. And I mean, that's all well and good. But think about it. You call a chick a bitch in real life? And say she's your friend or something, and you say, "Hey, bitch, get over here!" And you're not fuck, and you're not playing around. She's gonna get pissed as fuck at you. Oh, trust me, I've had a chick do that shit before to me. I mean, I said, "Hey, what's good, bitch?" And yeah, she got all pissed off. And I will say, I'll never do that shit again because of the fact that one, she kicked me in the nuts, and that shit does not feel good. But and two. It's just disrespectful. I mean, I'll, okay. Like I've said multiple of times before in my videos, I do plan on moving to Japan. I do fucking plan on it. I mean, we sit here and judge everybody by fucking just doing stupid ass shit. I mean, I could be sitting here playing this right now and fucking go talk to a friend of mine in real life and he could be like, oh, why the fuck do you play that shit? That shit's so fucking lame. Yeah, but has he ever tried it? Has he ever played it? No. I mean, it's just one of those things that a lot of people don't understand. You gotta try it to fucking know. You gotta try it to actually be, to actually like it. <laughs> but like I mean there's just a lot of shit that a lot of people don't understand behind in this country like I mean a lot of times yeah a lot of people look good and shit I mean we have people that are doing good for themselves yes but like in all reality when it comes down to it fucking it seems like they're scared to help each other out or they're scared to help their family out i mean yeah i understand i understand that shit i mean hell in all honesty i do plan on helping my family once i get a good job and fucking get out of job corps and all of that shit i do plan on helping out a lot of people i mean 
I'm not gonna sit there and just fucking hate my family because of this or because of that or because, say, in other words, my mom, she came into my room last night and fucking bitched at me because I had dishes in my room. <laughs> I ain't gonna sit there and hate her because of that. Nah. I mean, that's my own downfall. I should keep my fucking room clean. <laughs> but, I mean, it's just one of those things that you... That a lot of people don't understand. This wor- this country, in fact... This country has been named, deemed the number one most worst and dangerous country to live in. I mean, hell, we got people up in L.A. We got people up in L.A. sitting there trying to kill each other because of a color yeah don't get me wrong don't get me wrong it's out of respect for that color but you know i'm sorry you want to sit there and take another man's life just because of a color dude what about his kids what about his family what about his mom what about his dad what about his uncle what about his aunt what about what about their sons i mean sons daughters nieces nephews all of that shit i mean it's just one of those things you gotta stop and think about it's not worth it and you're gonna take a life so you're gonna do your life in prison at that i mean it's why do we i mean a lot of people don't understand i mean okay i like i said before i get it it's out of respect for that color But, I mean, for real? You gotta go out, shoot a motherfucker in cold blood, or, sorry, my bad, I shouldn't have used motherfucker, I should have used person. You're gonna go shoot somebody, somebody, okay, somebody, that's that's even better. You're gonna go out and shoot somebody in cold fucking blood just because they're wearing a color. I mean... Now, I could understand, I could completely and utterly understand why, but, I mean, it's just kind of pathetic, if you ask me, because, I mean, you want to sit there and kill someone just because, oh, he dissed your set, bruh, bruh, really, I mean, like I said before, Don't get me wrong, I understand, but for real. That shit's actually pretty fucking stupid. You're gonna spend the rest of your life in prison just because he said something about your say. That's if you get caught. But, I mean, even still, at that, you're still gonna go out there and kill people and become a mass fucking murderer and more than likely get caught. Or whatever, just because... He dissed your set. For real. I mean, hell. When I was younger, I used to fucking do all that shit. Well, I didn't kill people. I fucking beat the fuck out of them, but I didn't kill people. And hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I gotta do this. Look at this scenery. It is so beautiful. Except for the giant crab behind me. But, as I was saying, it's just wrong. I mean, no matter how you look at it, it's just wrong. And, like I said, I understand it's all because of a set and because of a color. But, I mean, it just seems like it's kind of fucked up. You're willing to kill somebody. Okay, like, okay, I see on the news every day now. Or not, well, nine times out of ten every single fucking day. People going out and killing a cop. I mean, you're going to kill said cop, what, just because you don't like a cop? Or you're getting pulled over and you're wanted for something? Hell, if you're wanted, then you shouldn't have done what you did. I mean, for real though, like, you want to sit there and get pissed pissed off at the cop because he pulled you over for a normal traffic ticket... But you want to sit there and pull a gun out and shoot him. Like, on the real, that's low. And it's really fucked up. 
what about his family? What about his kids? What about his wife? What about his daughter? What about his mom? What about everybody? I mean, it's just one of those things. You want to shoot a cop just because he pulled you over, bro. That that's that's really fucking stupid if you think about it because I mean, you got people out there that's going to be fucking suing the hell out of you. I mean, I'm sorry, I don't know about y'all, but I really don't put up with lawsuits and I really don't like lawsuits. But, you know, if you want one, you go for it. But I'm just saying. Okay, next topic. All these people playing Pokemon Go. How the fuck do you guys keep getting hella strong Pokemon? Like, for real. I, I, I live out in the middle of nowhere. I have barely any fucking Pokemon coming near me. And... You, I see all y'all sitting there playing it, and you, you're you getting level 1,000 CP, or fucking, uh, 1,000 CP, fucking all this good shit. I mean, for real, how the hell are you guys getting all that shit? <laughs> I mean, help a bro out. I mean, for real. I mean, like, I, I'm wanting to get those good Pokemon, too. And to the dude who caught every single Pokemon in the world, I give you props. I give you props, bruh. You are a true fucking Pokemon master. I mean, that's just epic. I, I know I sound probably a little corny or whatever, fucking... But, you know, I give you mad props for that shit. Fucking collecting every single Pokemon in the world, dude, that's amazing. Alright, next topic. But this is actually kind of the same topic as last. I mean, back to the whole bullying aspect. You want to bully someone, dude? Take a step back and think about what... Take a, look in the, take a look in their shoes. You don't know what their home life is like. You don't... I mean, even the bully... I don't know what your life is like, but, you know, that don't mean I'm going to sit there and fucking call you out, beat the fuck out of you, shove you in a locker or some shit. Nah, I'm just saying, you you don't know what their home life like is like, and you and they don't know you, yours. I mean, it's just too simple. And just because you want to bully him just to fucking bully him, that's beyond wrong. I mean... You're bullying somebody just to fucking bully him because he said something about you. Fucking blow it off, dude. I mean, what's the point? I mean, you're going to sit there and make this big fucking ordeal and beat the fuck out of somebody just because you want to because they said this about you or they said that about you. I mean, really, bruh. Really, bruh. I mean, like I said, I used to get bullied too, all the time. I have multiple scars on my wrist, on my arm, on my leg. Because of bullying. I mean, it's just one of those things. You don't know what the after effect is. I mean, a lot of people, a lot of people actually killed themselves or tried to kill themselves because of the fact that they were being bullied. I mean, we look at our country, and all we see is people, no, no bullying, no bullying, but yet it still goes on. What's the point? What, what's, I'm not trying to sound, contradict myself, but what's the point in trying to stop bullying if they're still doing it? I mean, no matter what we do in our life, we are going to get bullied, yes. I mean, bullied by our boss, bullied at school, bullied by our brothers and sisters, bullied at everybody. But, you know, sometimes bully, bullies, y'all need to take a step back, like, for real. I mean, like I said, I used to cut all the fucking time. I got so many scars up and down my wrist, on my arm, fucking all that shit because of bullying. And it's just wrong. I mean, you want to sit there and like I said before, you want to bully somebody just because they don't wear Jordans. 
You want to bully somebody just because they wear blue shoelaces and, and you're a fucking blood. I mean, that's really fucked up. I mean, hell, I've gotten bullied because I've gotten bullied by a couple of bloods and a couple of crips because, well, I wasn't wearing red shoelaces. I was wearing yellow, but I used to get bullied a lot, and I mean, it's just wrong that people want to sit there and bully somebody just because of a fucking color. I mean, like I said, don't get me wrong. I know what that color represents. It represents your hood, your set, your whatever. But, I mean, it's just wrong in general. And the reason why I say it's wrong is because of the fact that... What the fuck is all that shit? The reason why I say it's wrong is because of the fact that... Why bully somebody when you could actually try to get to know them, try to be their friend? I mean... I have, I've hung out with a lot of people. I've hung out with the Bloods. I've hung out with the Crips. I've hung out with the Nortes, the Serenos, the fucking Latin Kings. Fucking everybody. I hang out with everybody. I mean, just because you're one person or one set or whatever doesn't mean that you necessarily have to not talk to him. I mean, hell, I sit here, I sit here and I look at a lot of stuff, and I watch a lot of movies, and all I see is people sitting there bullying other people, I mean, and they've known each other since they were little kids, little kids, I mean, for real, you want to sit there and get pissed off because he's one color and you're another, and You've known each other since fucking little. I mean, for real. I'm sorry, I have to. <laughs> but, I mean... It, 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 it's just... Sometimes the anti-bullies, the anti-bullying people, and the anti-bullying, and the anti-bullying people and the anti-bullying companies, they actually cause some of the bullying. Because they're like, oh, no, nah, I don't want to fuck with, nah, I'm going to sit here and be the fuck out of this kid because he don't like me. Why? There must be a reason why he don't like you. I mean, for real. You want to sit there and get all pissed off at the kid just because he don't like you? I mean, for real. I mean, yeah, I may talk a lot of shit, and I may talk a lot of shit in general. But, like... Still, I'm not going to sit there and bully somebody. I mean, it's just wrong to bully someone when... Oh, shit, he's level 92. I'm fucked. It... 
and just bullying somebody is just wrong in all ways. I mean... I mean, it, it's just... It's just one of those things that I don't like. I mean, a lot of people... A lot of people want to sit there... I mean, okay. Like, all of these pe rappers and shit... They... All they do is display guns, violence, sex, and drugs, and money. And it, it's like... It's like... Fucking really? And what the hell was that? Oh shit, what the hell was that? Ooh, nice hit, nice hit. Dash. Ah, I can't use it. No, leave me alone, soul. No, I'm gonna die. And I died. I didn't even I I didn't even get a hit on you really. And with that being said, alright guys, it's been your boy Tiki Toby 420X here, and remember, peace, love, and gaming makes the world go around. And also, I want to give a shout out to Baby Metal, Bandmade, Akira Mon, Amuru, Amu. And I want to give a shout out to the Free Knights, and I want to give out to the sh I want to give a shout out to the Clan 420X. And remember, peace, love, gaming makes the world go round nowadays. All right, guys, I'll catch you later. Late.